channel this is Ajit Kumar and today we will create a VM using template deployment uh, basically we will create a VM using custom deployment so first of all you just go to that uh, search option and here you have to search the template deployment so as you can see here in the marketplace the template deployment is available so you just click on that after that you will get the template so here we are having windows virtual machine template available so proceeding to that okay so here you can mention all the details or either you can edit the template so here we will add it the template so just put all the details hmm, okay if you want to wish detail uh, wish 2012 r2 or any other so let me change i will be deploy 2012 r2 so the version will be t2 v3 if you want to customize that you you have to put the size here okay so the nick will be deploy or uh, the subnet will be deploy and the vnet mine vnet will be deploy so So here you have to save the button as you can see here these are the resources will be deployed parallelly when the VM will be create so the first one is the storage account and the, and the second one is public IP name which will be the public IP will be create parallelly third will be the network security group fourth will be the VNet through which the VM will be connect uh, VNet and this will be the NIC card which will be connect to the virtual machine and finally this will be the VM so I'm going to save this okay here you need to choose the resource group so here you need to uh, let me check the parameter as well so as you can see here the, the the parameter is available so the admin name and the password so you can put here either you can put in letter so i'm going to save this here you here you can also put the username and password so i am putting here admin so this will be the so i am going to keep this uh, public IP is uh, uh, static okay so the VM name I going I'm going to change this I'm putting here 2012 R2 just going to proceed review and create seems like some issue okay so
so i'm going to remove this which is not required in my case I'm going to save this proceeding to review and create still i'm getting some error okay here we missed the resource group name going to proceed review and create let's run the validation still we are getting some error okay the domain name label is not valid okay so going to the previous and leaving as it is simple let's run the validation so as you can see the validation is passed so i'm going to create this So all the item got deployed, uh, it's waiting for VM to be deployed. So as you can see here, NS is created, my public IP is created. Here is the storage account which is created. Here is the VNet and the NIC is created. Now my sim, uh, the VM is now creating with the name simple. So still uh, deployment is going on. So as you can see here, the VM is got deployed so I'm going to the resource group and check the VM so as you can see here the VM is got deployed naming simple let me go to that VM so so as you can see here the public IP is available and the private IP is also So going to the boot diagnostics. So as you can see here, 2012 R2 is available. Let me RDP to this in this VM using public IP.
so as you can see here I am able to RDP to this VM So as you can see my VM is available. Let me run the system info to get the details. So as you can see I just installed this created this uh, OS and good time is available so this is how we can create as you can see here the host name is available as a simple okay so this is all about how we can create a VM using custom uh, deployment using template de deployment and we can easily uh, create a VM using the custom deployment so hope this video is really helpful to you so please subscribe my channel and like this video and if any query please mention in the comment section so that i will answer that thank you so much